No, no, no. Bad creepers. Very bad creepers. Die already! Okay. Hi, everyone, and welcome to episode 16 of the Casually Avid Gamer Plays Minecraft and Minecraft. I'm glad you guys are here. Now, I am over in the uh, cathedral. Uh, well, technically, I guess I'm under the cathedral right now because I'm tired of staring at the dirt floors and the road that runs through where our... Uh, the cathedral floor is supposed to be. So I want to get the cathedral floor in. And like everywhere else, we're starting we're starting with just stone brick. That's that's our canvas. And so I need to get there that in. We'll see exactly how it looks. And then after that, that's when we really start making the inside look really awesome. So I'm going to start by tearing out. Let's see. Well, I've got I got the road out, so now it's time to, I think I'll put some stone brick in there if I could get back up, which I don't know that I can, but I'm going to try. We'll run this way. That's fine. I'm panicking. I don't want to die. But yeah, we're going to get the, uh, we get the road out. We're going to get some more stone brick in and then we'll start taking out the dirt floor. How did he get in here? Well, I'm guessing the big door, but maybe not. Come on, come on, you can do it. There you go. Oh no, oh no, oh no you don't. No, 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 bad creepers. Very bad creepers. Die already! Okay, I feel better. I've got the floor out in there, and I've got it replaced with uh, stone brick half slabs. And I'll go and show you in a second, but... <laughs> yeah, this is everything we had to cut out. Like, I don't... This is this is the floor that was there before. We had to take all of that out and replace it with stone brick half slabs. So we used up a ton of stone brick, and now we've got an ungodly amount of dirt. I have no idea what to do with, but it can stay here for now. Let's let's check out the inside. Now, I spent a lot of work between episodes. This and the last, obviously, um, filling in gaps in our floor and or in our ceiling and I did the floor today and then I spent some time and it, it's kind of pointless because it's not the final lighting but I lit up everything because I want you guys to see this well first you can see we've got the floor in there and looks better than the dirt looks better than the road coming in there but look at this place okay just look at it is this is this is ama This looks amazing already, guys. Like, <laughs> all that hard work seems to be paying off quite a bit. And what's really crazy is this looks... Like I said, I think this looks amazing already. This is just the canvas. Um, this is absolutely just the canvas. Now, if you don't know what that means, if you haven't been subscribed to my channel for a while, uh, you might not know how I really go about building... When I'm building pretty much anything, I start with something basic and bland and boring and just simple. And then I keep layering on color, texture, depth, detail, uh, on and on. And this, this is just the bland and boring beginning. <laughs> like even, okay, that looks pretty cool, but we need to get that in anyway. Maybe, so maybe there's a little bit of a depth and texture there. But yeah, it's just the beginning. The, the the stone brick was only meant to be the base. So we're going to do some awesome things with these pillars. We are going to just, we're going to make this place rock. Now, I've still got dirt stuff everywhere. And I was thinking about throwing in uh, spruce pews. Well, I think I'm going to use spruce wood for the pews. But here's my consideration. When I decided that I wanted this type of roof in the main area, I needed a square roof. And I had only had marked off for the entire cathedral to go to about here. This was the back. However, that wasn't square. 
and we need a square. So I, I cut the building open wider. I cut the back floor uh, back a little wider uh, or back a little deeper. Uh, but before I had done that, I had already kind of temporarily placed out where I wanted things. So uh, this was going to be where... I'll, I'll sleep here in a minute. This is going to be where the, the, the choir would sit, uh, kind of in an elevated place off to the side so everybody could see the the bishop or the cardinal or whoever's giving the 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 sermon or whatever uh and then here was supposed to be uh the the preaching platform the altar or not the altar but like where the 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 priest would stand and give the sermons and then this was going to be the holy symbol hanging here and then about here would be the back wall now we've got all this space and I'm not quite sure what to do with it. Uh, so I need to think on that for a little bit so we can figure out exactly how best we want to use this space. So it's going to take some think boxing and I'll probably put in some, uh, like again, some, some temporary bricks or some temporary dirt just to kind of map out things. But I don't think I'm going to make a for sure decision this episode. So actually, yeah, that's a great, uh, great idea, me. I'm brilliant. Uh, if you guys have thoughts about how to use the, the space, uh, by all means, chime in down in the in the comments. That I'd like to hear from you. I'd like to hear your thoughts on you know how this is looking already. So please, please, super please, please hop down in the comments and just let me know what's up. Okay, and I just wanted to kind of give you guys uh, an idea of what it looks like when you walk into it. Okay, is that awesome or is that awesome? Uh, like, it just, the the size and scale of it, it just kind of draws your eye upwards. Uh, this is, this build has been tough at points, but man, oh man, is it coming out great. Wow. Wow. Like, okay, yeah, let's just, let's, okay, I'm just going to stare at this for a bit because <laughs> I think we did good, guys. I think we really did good. If I'm going to make the, the pews out of uh, spruce, that means that I'll probably use spruce in the, the, the choir seats, maybe some in the altar. So we're going to probably need quite a bit of it. So let's do that didn't mean to do that all right let's cut this bad boy down how oh not terribly tall is it all right well tall enough so usually what I do I I cut a spiral up to the top and then chop my way down I don't know if there's I've never really found a way that works better for me some people like to just uh, take ladders and put ladders in all the way up to the top and then cut their way down from that but eh, it seems like involving ladders one more thing to despawn I don't know I don't know I just I did I started doing it this way and then I frankly I think it might be that I'm too lazy to change so another thing I know I already asked you guys to go down in the comments and give me your thoughts on how the, the cathedral's looking and what to do with the space. But I'd also like to ask you guys to do a little bit more too. What other builds do we want to kind of do? Um, I need suggestions for smaller builds because I think too much. Uh, we I've just been working on the cathedral. That's it. And I want to give you guys a little bit of a variety. So what other types of uh, uh, builds would you like us to see? Uh, I, I do want to do some collabs. Collabs have be, been problematic because my life schedule is so busy and the times I generally have free to uh, play Minecraft, it just seems like, well, you look now, there's there's nobody on. I was on a little bit earlier and Luke and XB were on for just a little bit, but my, my paths don't cross terribly often with, uh, or as often as I'd like with other iCrafters. So that's made uh, shenanigans and uh, collaborations a little bit tricky. I, I do want to do more. I really do because they're just some really, really awesome people on this server and I definitely want to work with them. It's just I have I said it's tricky because it is. <laughs> so uh, 
But yeah, give me some ideas of little builds or just stuff you might like to see an episode or two out of. That would be that would be super helpful to me, guys. So, uh, <laughs> looks like Dude Plays Elevator has an attendant now. <laughs> Hi, buddy. <laughs> uh, do I throw him something so he doesn't despawn? I think I throw him something so he doesn't despawn. And... Uh, dude can kill him if he wants, but I don't want to cost him his opportunity for a, for a, a what you call it, a, an attendant. Did he pick it up? He didn't pick it up. Where'd it go? Let's jump and give it. Did he not get it? One more time. Oops. Okay, if he's not picking it up now, that's because some some fault that's not mine. <laughs> well, uh, dude, if you're watching, <laughs> there there may be a potential elevator attendant here. Uh, I don't know. You'll have to you'll have to talk to him about it. I don't know what his wage demands are. You know, I've talked an awful lot in the last recent episodes about how the stone brick is just a canvas, and we've had to work really hard to get it in, and so far we've got the canvas for the inside. So we're in a couple of options. We can start trying to figure out the canvas for the outside, or we can start detailing the inside. And I'm tired of working on canvas, and honestly, I... <laughs> <laughs> I I want to show you, give you guys kind of an idea of how I'm thinking about we can go about uh, prettying this bad boy up. So uh, we're going to work on the pillars today, and and we're just going to, you know, we're going to give them a little bit of punch. So let's go there. Next. Oh, yes. Don't need these currently. One, two... Oh, that's not good. There. All right, so we're there. Oh, and there's one other thing we got to do. I forgot. We've got this we need to take care of down here. Feels bad chopping all these out when I worked so hard this episode to get them all in. But that's the thing with canvas. You you cover it up. You change it out. Whatever. Okay. And I figured we'd start would start working in some some nether brick into the build. Uh, it's darker color will give a more somber aspect, I think, to the build, which isn't a bad thing when you're talking about a cathedral. And yes, sea lanterns. We're gonna use a ton of them. <laughs> there we go. that and a couple more sea lanterns okay next stairs Last bit. One, two, one, two. We'll put the uh, ah. There we go. Put the chisel there. All right. So that's what we're gonna do with the pillar. Let me get out my shovel. We'll go down and take a look. So already that looks a lot more visually interesting than just that type of pillar does. Um, and then up here, we're going to work something in where uh, we're going to work in some three dimensionality. So there will be protrusions coming from where the pillars start to flare out here, just so that this one doesn't look so completely out of place. Uh, when we get everything done, it'll look It'll, little, it'll look a lot more blended, but already this looks so much more interesting. 
And it's this sort of thing we want to do throughout the whole build. I've already done the pillars on this side. And yeah, they just... I think they look better. They just, they look better. So yeah, so I'm going to finish getting those in. And actually, why don't we go ahead and wrap up the episode there? Um, because, and then I'll just get uh, the rest of the uh, pillars redone here between episodes. I'm running out of recording time. Uh, I've, I lost, or I, recording didn't go as quickly as I wanted it to this weekend. So sorry about that so we couldn't make more progress than this but this looks great that looks amazing that's looking really good uh we've got a long way to go on this yet but so much is looking great already so thank you guys for tuning in to this episode of the casually avid gamer plays minecraft on iCraft. i if you guys are new to my channel, please cl click that subscribe button. If you're not and you're returning, please click that like button. Leave me some comments. I always love hearing from you guys. I want you guys to have a great week. We'll talk to you next time.